such a great relief <laughs> to, to be introduced to a way of using my mind that requires no effort whatsoever, that's based in complete relaxation and total naturalness, just completely allowing myself to be as I am, making no effort to change the flow of my thoughts and emotions, complete relaxation. You can try it right now. <laughs> and um, there's something that I sort of heard about, oh, yeah, it's good to relax. It's good to relax all through my life. Yeah, 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 just relax, it's good, yeah. And, um, and sort of trying to relax and thinking that relaxation came with like the right sort of thoughts and emotions, that anyone knows that. So you're like relaxed and then it's all like positive thoughts and emotions because now I am relaxed. So this is good. It's a good thing to do, so that's what it, it comes under that camp <laughs> of experience and descriptions. But what we can see in an instant is that our minds are completely unpredictable. <laughs> Your thoughts and emotions are totally ceaseless, countless, unpredictable. You don't know what's going to pop up next. We don't know. The thought you had a moment ago, where's it gone? The next one that's going to pop up, what is it? You don't know. <laughs> I used to have this little game when I was younger. I was like, I can predict my next thought. <laughs> so cute. And like, Blackberry. No, but I just, you know, told myself that. And, um, <laughs> but we just have no idea what the next thought is going to be. And, um, and but what we do see is everything is just spontaneously and naturally and completely effortlessly arising and resolving arising and resolving all thoughts, emotions and experiences, data streams. This moment fresh and new, completely fresh and new. Each moment fresh and new. And what remains constant is your power to know. Open intelligence that you're just introduced to. Bright, open intelligence shining right here, inseparable from everything you experience all data streams. And uh, it's a, such a simple introduction and such a simple recognition. But in my experience, so life changing to recognize what's at the basis of all experience and rest there. To rest mind and body completely to relax completely into the great intelligence that is on, always on, that's inseparable from you and everything you perceive, vast and open, has no limit. And you see, you have no limit to where you perceive. Isn't that amazing? <laughs> Just goes on and on, is there in every moment. Open intelligence, completely present. And so to test this out in our experience of short moments, the short moments are for you to test, to see. Is open intelligence present? To just check that out no matter what is arising. And uh, for me it was very, it started to very quickly change the way I related to my experience in my life in such a natural way to recognize open intelligence for a short moment. And, um, you know, I was a self-confessed, uh, positive, obsessed with being positive. <laughs> so that was the main project, to keep all the data streams, you know, nice and um, shiny and, you know, rosy and feeling good and, and being with other people who felt good, so I felt good you know, not hanging out with too much negativity and um, having a, I can remember one, one day waking up quite some years ago and just being like, wow, I'm just so happy. <laughs> I, this is just, I've got, a, I've got a great partner, I've got a great place to live, I'm doing a great project that I love. Ah, oh, this is it. Made it. And then I think it was a couple of days, I don't think, or maybe I had a whole day of sort of generally feeling, yeah, this is it. And then this sort of 
different thoughts and feelings just started popping up of like annoyance or frustration or boredom or you know and then then looking to why am I feeling bored mm, maybe, maybe that partner maybe maybe he's not all I took him to be and I just need to uh, start removing myself from this situation subtly or slowly or you know that project that I was working on actually the people I'm working with I don't think we're quite a match and uh, yeah I need to make some changes there to, to bring back to bring back that original situation somehow that actually where I was happy because that's where all the the happiness is coming from produced by my circumstances now the introduction to open intelligence what we get to know is an indwelling complete well-being in every moment that's our nature that's the nature of our mind that's our true nature and the the gift of the short moments is testing that out for ourselves as data streams arise and what I saw for myself is the relaxation from obsessing with describing my experience all the time giving it labels labeling as happy sad you know what's going on describing things creating stories turning them into issues <laughs> and instead choosing short moments of complete relaxation short moments of complete perceptual openness allowing the current data stream just to be as it is allowing it to arise and resolve like it does naturally and flow on by and um, with this practice and with the with the support of the Balanced You Training, we're taking up the program of training, finding more and more there was this availability and ease in my own experience and a clarity of really seeing how I do want to live and not based on this ever-changing display of thoughts and emotions but really open and rooted and balanced, stable, stable in myself to really choose, to really see how I want to respond moment by moment my um my sister once uh, I, I i found that i met the training about 10 years ago and um a few years ago i was speaking with my sister and uh and she said yeah liz you used to be a bit like a sort of little ping pong ball really mm. like you know something would come up and off you'd go you know change your situation you just sort of there was no yeah you were just all over the place basically and i reflect and i was like wow it's so was it just at the drop of a hat being like something's not right this feeling comes up of like something needs to change and then change the relationship or the job or the location and uh, surely that's going to make it all better and realizing that it just was never a permanent solution the next data stream would come up so what we want is a permanent solution where we where we get to know the the complete well-being regardless of circumstances and this is found in recognizing the nature of our mind in recognizing and relying and training up open intelligence great stability openness beneficial power this is this is what we are as human beings so really getting familiar with that power for ourselves and seeing how we want to use it moment by moment you know, firstly starting with ourselves, coming into a completely harmonious relationship with ourselves and then everyone in our life and then really seeing how we want to contribute to the world and this is the capacity, this is the balance you training training up our fundamental beneficial power getting to know it in all areas, in all areas including all our thoughts and emotions and experiences and uh, some some of you here will be starting the 12 empowerments today <laughs> congratulations and um and yeah for me that the 12 empowerments training was the start i feel of my true education in being an empowered human being like really taking responsibility for my life and my power and how i can contribute it and it starts with taking such a clear look at ourselves and seeing that all of our data streams, all of our belief systems, our ideas, our assumptions and relationships are completely included in the beneficial power of open intelligence and then there's a beautiful process of harmonizing relationships and really seeing how we can be of benefit in the world and making that our 
stable basis in which to live, and that's incredible. The, the balance you training is a, a gift for you to take up as much as you would like and explore. The reason I sit here and share is because I'm just so passionate about it, you know, like seeing the results in myself, and not just in myself, but seeing the results in my family, you know? Like when, when one person makes a shift to, to not emphasize issues anymore, then there's just, and rely on open intelligence, there's a greater openness. Basically, love, warmth, and openness, this is our most fundamental capacity. And it just comes to the fore, and not through getting rid of any data streams. We don't have to change anything about ourselves or our circumstances. We find that open intelligence is available and present right here within the current thought and emotion. This is amazing. We don't need to fix ourselves anymore. It's the end of that. It was such a relief for me. I could just completely relax. I can completely relax and really, you know, see how I can take up this training and train up open intelligence. Test short moments, sh short moments repeated many times through your day. Maybe today when something's arising that, for me in the beginning, like, you know, data streams that I didn't like, like annoyance or feeling frustrated or nervous, you know, things like data that I really thought I needed to get rid of in, in order to be okay, in order to be confident and powerful and just be well, right there to test short moments of open intelligence, just to relax and let the data stream be as it is, and see that it resolved like mist in the air. It required no effort. It was just the pure benefit of this moment. When I relaxed all of the incessant describing and all the ideas I'd learned about it, it was great openness great availability, an immediate benefit. And that's what's available to each of us, and that's what comes about through this training. So it's a, yeah, incredible opportunity.